pick the two consonants that combine to make the th sound in words like there and then. The letters T and H, the same two consonants as before, because T and H combine to make both the th sound in there and then and the th sound in thumb, thick, and thunder. Excellent. Find the word that has the th sound, just like in the words there and then. This one. T-H-A-T. M-A-T. That. The word is that. That's the word. What? Did you say that? Incredible! Whoa! That's another word in the name of our game. You now have the words blue, spell, and that. Just two more words to go and you win the grand prize. Don't stop now. I don't want to stop. This is fun. Let's answer some more questions. Not so fast, Teddy. Let me tell you what you've won. 13 thimbles and 30 thermometers. Isn't that swell? Now, can we get back to the game? Right, okay, here we go. Find the two consonants that combine to make the w sound in words like whip and whistle. These two consonants, W and H. The consonants W and H combine to make the w sound in whip and whistle. And sometimes they have the h huh sound of H in hole and hose. But that's the exception to the rule. Great answer. You're really paying attention. Here's a whale, a swan, a block, and a phone. Pick the one that starts with the h huh sound. It's whale. The word whale starts with the w sound made by combining W and H. Whale. W-H-A-L-E. Whale. Now find another word that starts with the w sound, as in the words whistle, whip, and whale. This word, w-e-o. Wheel. The W and the H at the beginning of the word have the W sound. W-H-E-E-L. Wheel. Fantastic. Absolutely astounding. Truly and completely amazing. You have picked another word in the name of our game. The word wheel. Now you have blue, spell, that, and wheel. Only one more to go, and you win the grand prize. I understand how two consonants at the beginning of a word can blend together or combine to make a new sound. But what about two consonants at the end of a word? There's still one word in the name of the game that I don't know, and it has two consonants at the end. And that's because consonants can blend or combine to make new sounds at the end of a word, just like they do at the beginning of a word. When two consonants are at the end of a word, the consonant sounds are going to blend in the word to produce the sounds we love to hear. Read them left to right, my friend, and remember when they're at the end, two consonants are at the end of a word. The consonant sounds are going to blend in the word. When two consonants are at the end of a word, the consonant sounds are going to blend in the word. And now, back to the game. Bertha has already spun the wheel again, and our new category is words that end with the consonants G and H, and words that end with the consonants N and G. We didn't combine these consonants at the beginning of any words, did we? No! These combinations occur at the end of words. The consonants N and G combine at the end of words to make the ng sound, like in the words gong, song, ping, and pong. Ping pong! <laughs> and the consonants G and H combine at the end of a word to make a sound, just like the letter F. The words laugh, cough, rough, and tough. But sometimes the GH at the end of the word is silent, like in the words do, though, sigh, and hi. Yes, it's a tall subject indeed. <laughs> now, here's a king. A queen, 
a troll, and a tooth. Choose the one that ends with the ng sound, as in the words sing and song. It's king. The word king ends with the ng sound made by the consonants N and G. K-I-N-G. King ends with ng. Sound of N and G combined together. And so do sing, song, and ping pong. And hang, and long, and Hong Kong. Right, Teddy. Pick the two consonants that combine at the end of a word to make the sound. Like the sound of the letter F. These two letters, G and H. The consonants G and H make the sound, like the letter F, at the end of words like rough and tough. These questions aren't too tough for me. Had enough? No way! I want more questions. All right. Find the word with the silent G-H at the end. This word, H-I-G-H. Hi! The word hi ends with a silent G-H. You just sound out the first two letters. Huh, I, hi. The sound of the consonant H is ha. Huh. The vowel I has its long vowel sound I. And the consonants G and H at the end are silent. H-I-G-H, hi. Hey, you're pretty smart. Let's see how you do with the next category. Bertha, spin the wheel and tell us what it is. And this is our final category, Bob. Words that end with the consonants S and H. And words that end with the consonants T and H. Hey, we already used SH and TH at the beginning of words. That's right, Teddy. And the SH and TH combinations make the same sound in either position. The SH at the end of the word fish makes the same sh sound as the SH at the beginning of the word ship. Cast ass flesh mesh with this fish plus plus mush push whoosh swoosh now SH at the front or SH at the rear. SH is what we say and what we hear. And that reminds me of another one of our prizes today. A sheep wearing shoes with a fish on a leash. Why would I want something like that? Oh, don't pay any attention to him. I had to give him the job. He's my brother-in-law from New York. That's right. Live from New York, it's... Just answer this question. Pick the two consonants that combine to make the sh sound at the end of the words dish and cash. The consonants S and H make the sh sound at the end of the words dish and cash. And they make the same sh sound at the beginning of words like shoe and shine. Here's a snail, a swan, a whale, and a fish. Choose the one that ends with the sh sound. It's fish. The word fish combines the consonants S and H to make the sh sound at the end of the word. F-I-S-H. Fish. Hey, kid. I guess you're not as wet as I thought you were. But are you ready for the final question? Sure. Let's go. Okay. Our final question is about words that end with the consonants T and H. I remember that combination. We use T and H at the beginning of words like thick and thumb. That's right, Teddy. And the TH at the end of a word sounds just like the TH at the beginning of a word, like thick or thumb. The consonants T and H at the end of the words booth, mouth, and tooth make the same sound as the T and H at the beginning of the words thunder, Thin and thin. Well, it's time for the final question. Find the word that ends with the sound like in the words tooth and mouth. Uh, 
I know. It's this word. W -i -th. With. The word with ends with the consonants T and H, making the th sound. W I T H. With. I can't believe it. It's spectacular. It's absolutely fantastic. It's incredible. With is the final word in the name of our game. Now you know the whole name of your favorite TV show. The show where you are a contestant. Spell with that blue wheel. Spell with that blue wheel. Spell with that blue wheel. That's the name of the show. You got it. That's it. That's the name of the show. <laughs> Spell with that blue wheel. That's it. Congratulations, Teddy. You won our grand prize. Bertha, tell Teddy exactly what he's won. You won an autographed blue shoe of King Bang. <laughs> he's not Frankenstein, no Count Dracula. As a matter of fact, he's more spectacular. He's not a whale or an alien. If I met him in an attic, I'd never go back again. He's king. Gigantic king thing, he's the king. Gigantic king thing, he's the king. The most gigantic king thing. <laughs> hey, I thought I got to announce all the prizes. And that was my favorite. All right, the end of another show. All you kids at home, make sure you're here next time for another episode of Spell with that Blue Wheel, the show where you at home are the contestant. <laughs> I don't need any silly old prizes. I'm already a winner because now I know more words than ever. And pretty soon, I can start reading. Ooh, sure you can, Teddy. Now sing the song. <laughs> Bye, Teddy. You get a bright start with video smarts down the road to learning. You get the right start with video smarts, and I know we'll enjoy the journey because learning is fun for everyone. And the big surprises will never be done because the more we learn, the more we're gonna wanna learn and learn and learn and learn. The more we learn, the more we're gonna wanna learn, the more we know. The more we're gonna wanna know, the more we grow. The more we're gonna wanna grow and learn and know and learn and grow. So, you get a bright start with video smarts down the road to learning. You get the right start with video smarts, and I know we'll enjoy the journey because learning is fun.